May I help you? I, I, I was looking for Faith. You're out of luck. What was that? I'm a secular humanist. It's a joke. Ah, yes. No, um, I meant this. A pressed coin. Exonumia. Things, Things that, that aren't, aren't real, real money. money. We have quite a bit of that sort of thing around here. You know, they say that money doesn't grow on trees, yet so much currency is printed on paper. Mm. Let me help you with that. Nice oh, tail. Thanks. There's a shark. A little tiny leopard shark. Mabel? Mabel? What have you done? Just sit still, Mabel. In this getup? Oh, wow. look at that, the original. USS Bacon. Hey, uh, Henry, I don't know how much longer our light's gonna last. Think we got it at that last one? Oh, I think we got it. That last one was right on the money. Why would anyone do this? You look fantastic, honey. You'll be a star. Hey, watch the camera! That's him! Danny? Oh, jeez. No respect for art. James, what's going on? Rum runners. Rum runners? Rum runners. Prohibition. Don't worry, Mabel. They're gone. You sure showed them. James, are you ready? Your friend there is pretty talented, James. You should take him with you to the maid dance. Wouldn't miss it. <laughs> Allow me to introduce myself, Larry Taylor. This is Henry Fontaine. His dance partner in Muse, Mabel Rose, and of course. Well, the afternoon is certainly disappearing. I uh, still have a bit of work to do here. Let me finish up and we can be on our way. I was just on my way out. Anna, shall we? No, that's all right, you go on. Larry, it was nice to see you. I'm actually looking out for a little Danny McDonald. He was supposed to be home hours ago. The squirt he probably just topped the train like the rest of his brothers. His family's had it hard ever since his dad died. Miss O'Connor asked me to look out for him. I'll be waiting outside, James. Really? You're gonna wait for him? Well, uh, suit yourself. Well, it was lovely to meet you all. I uh, hope to see you again. Interesting man. Danny was working for him. I hope he's all right. Mm, all that Anna sure is something. I think she likes you. I, I have work to do. And you like her. Oh, she's lovely. You have to ask her to the dance. No, not a good idea. Ah, nothing ventured, nothing gained. What could go wrong? What? I, I can't dance. Ah. No, really, I, I can't dance. Everyone should dance. Heck, I'll teach you. Tango, the dance of. Romance. Slow. Slow. Quick, quick, slow. 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 Uh, uh, ouch. Oh, ouch. You just need to build your confidence. Nothing for it but to try. I'm off after seven. Now try without saying the steps. He's a madman. Oh. <laughs> oh, are you learning how to dance? Oh, don't stop on my account. Absolutely. This shows great promise. Don't know if I'd go that far. Would you like to cut in? Please, cut in. you learn to dance like that? Never mind. The last thing we both remember is the mermaid photo and the photo of the dancing couple, your shirt. Exactly. Yes. I think. They may have been developed at the same time. James, please. Larry Taylor? I think he's up to something. That would be convenient. I've given it some thought. Have you? Time travel often. 
Any guesses when they might be back around? The Dan's coming up. He's been coming around trying to get me to go with him. I bet he'll be back tomorrow. There's nothing foolish, James. No. I remember every trip our family ever took through time. Do you? Yes. And I have no idea how we got back. As I recall, sometimes some of us didn't. You should know better. That photograph was taken at the May dance. They have been doing that same May dance every year for ages. We will recreate the photo. Perfect. Meanwhile, Alexander Glass, dearest brother of mine, I would appreciate it if you didn't go rummaging through any more photos. Do I make myself perfectly clear? I understand. Good. As long as we're here. We follow them, right? I like these two. Pipe down! I want to wake up the whole neighborhood. Sorry, boss. Anything happens to this shipment, your mother hears about it. Goes right, you can take care of her for a whole year. It doesn't, I don't know. Why you gotta bring her into it? Danny, you're a good kid, that's why. Got potential. So, we just saw Larry with a big load of hooch. Got quite the school here, Henry. Everyone's been progressing nicely. Speaking of which, you two could use some practice. Now, they make a great team. <laughs> What were you two thinking? We followed him, of course. What about you two? He was threatening him. I knew it. If we go to the police, they'll just blame Danny. What if we get him to admit everything? So big-headed. He might just slip up at the dance tonight. You mean you'd be bait? Yes. Terrible idea. No. I'm game. Let's do it. For this dance. Anything? Not enough. Hello. I don't believe we've met your friends. Of course, you know Henry. Hey, would you like to dance? Nice to meet you, Lieutenant. You must be very brave. Not very, really. Don't let him be modest. Ted was just telling us this morning that he can see everything from that little spy car of his. Spy car? The basket hanging from it. It's how they see everything. Teddy is in charge of the most important part of the ship. 
She's exaggerating a bit. If you were looking out to the west, it would have been hard to miss us. We wouldn't have happened to notice anyone out on the water in the early hours. As a matter of fact, we were keeping watch for a local boy who was missing. Any luck with that? Yes, we spotted him at first light. He was playing lookout for some bootleggers. We were out there this morning too. What a relief you found Danny. He's in a bit of trouble, actually. But it wasn't his fault. There were extenuating circumstances. It was that man right there. That one. We heard the whole thing. That's him. Sure. May I have this dance? You mean to tell me that Larry Taylor has been running his gang out of my farm this whole time? And that McDonald boy? Things have gotten bad. We owe you an enormous debt, Lieutenant. Thank you, Anna. <gasps> Look at the young people dancing, Joe. We heard you've been giving lessons. You have a valuable skill. May I? But you never ask. Let's get a photograph of you two. Love to, Mrs. O'Connor. Well, it's been nice knowing you all. Oh, relax. It's just a picture, Mabel. Last time you said that, I was surrounded by sharks. Sharks! Now that sounds like a good story. No! How much for that pressed coin? Keep it. A souvenir. We should talk about Mom and Lucy. How about a film? I hear Jaws is playing across the street. I've had just about enough sharks for the moment. Thank you. Shape goes on my turtle dove, come on. Through. 